Hello everyone, my name is Fungusen and welcome back to this Imperator Rome campaign. So, um, still struggling a bit with these um, alliances. Now, we might just go to war here with Rhodos, because um, they're a defensive league with just one other guy, and we should be able to take this fairly easy. Now, having a look here, um, if we do attack this guy, then Patrai would be called in, which means that their uh, whole defensive league will come in. But we can call in Buitia, which is interesting. He is normal in this alliance, so I'm not sure whether we'd be able to get this going in first. In which case, we might be able to beat it. Now, unfortunately, this guy here, for some reason, has 25k troops and, you know, massive amounts of manpower and even more ridiculous amounts of money. So, he could rent, like, all the mercs in the world. Um, meanwhile, what I think we'll do is we'll, we'll try and improve a bit with Rome and see if we can get them to guarantee us as well. Doesn't hurt. You like me pretty well. You like me pretty well as well. Um, but maybe we want to improve with you just a bit as well. And possibly with Macedon. Just to make sure that they don't, you know, attack us or anything. Thrace is... I don't know, are they losing? Possibly, possibly. Um, so yeah, we still need to wait for this stupid modifier to drop off though, so that our morale actually recovers. Um, but that shouldn't be too bad. And yeah, we have a disloyal character, but they have literally no power whatsoever. So, yeah, that doesn't matter. And we are slowly but surely recovering manpower as well. We are making uh, a decent amount of money, actually. Tributes. Why are we getting tributes? Iron from Laconia. Now... Uh, no, we do have an additional one here. Okay. Yeah. Okay, very nice. So that's 15% extra discipline for the heavy infantry. So that is pretty sweet. We do not have this one, which gives an additional import route. Sure, let's go for that. Alright. Religious will win. Uh, that's fine. It's not the greatest one, but yeah. And sacrifice to the gods cost. Religious provincial improvement cost. Monthly war exhaustion. Yeah, go with that, and sure. National tribesman, we have like one tribesman. Wonder if we can see that. Okay, no, sorry, we have four tribesmen. That is okay. Province food, it is changing, rising, rising. This one's rising massively amount, so yeah. Oh, Crete is not actually importing anything. Well. Um, let's grab some... That. Uh, okay, we don't have any money now. Yeah. And in one year, approximately, we'll lose this modifier, so we actually start gaining money again. Right, Omen Power. And we can get a new Stratagos. Which... Sure. 
you'll be fine. Oh, well, someone's... you are scorned now. You do have... he is the researcher, he's the brother of the researcher, well good for him. So, he looks like the only one, well we do have... now that's a woman. Uh, that sounds very sexist. So, we do have a nine Diplo guy. So we could put him in charge here. There we go. Everyone's happy again. What? Did we actually gain morale? I thought it wasn't until... Lose 10 popularity and he loses loyalty. How's his loyalty going? Loyalty is rising. Because he's dumb. <laughs> <laughs> Excellent. <laughs> uh, I mean, these favors don't seem to do anything. Uh, but I don't need more support for them. No, no. I mean, sure, you, you can. <laughs> uh, okay, Agatha Barabaraba are oh, scorned now. You do have 12 thingamajigs, though. Um, actually, let's check research. How are you? You got 13. You got 8. We not got anyone better? Clearly not. You got 12. You got 9. Yeah, it's fine. Um, where am I going? Here. So yeah, you are right. They should warn you if you try to appoint someone. You have 9. Yeah, okay. So we can definitely get rid of you. So, you are the new guy. Excellent. We should call down an omen. Um, let's go for research points and let's actually do some sacrifice to the gods as well. You should disappear, yes. Disloyal characters don't really care because you have literally no no power whatsoever. So it is fine. Have a puny amount of manpower, so as long as nothing changes here, we can definitely attack you. We don't want to fight Phrygia. We don't really want to fight Macedon. We don't want to fight Phrygia. Phrygia. Oh, good! You're being guaranteed by... I'm surprised that you have that much with only one province, though. So the thing, this could obviously go horribly, horribly wrong. Um, opinion minus one. H how much do you... They don't like me. Why don't you like me? We are allies. Okay, fine. We're going to improve opinion with you as well, because why not? And we'll see if we can actually swing that. That would be pretty sweet. Apart from that, just going up to October. Well, we could speed up for now, actually, because we're not going to do much else. But it seems like it has recovered a bit of morale. Morale is being recovered because of the ruler marshal. Ah. Okay, yeah, that makes sense. So we're actually overcoming this lack of equipment. So clearly, lack of equipment is not going to cause any problem. Well, it's giving a bit of max morale. Is that the only thing? So clearly you don't need equipment to actually fight well. It just affects your morale. Does that make sense? Yeah. Okay. Right. Meanwhile, we decided to fall. Oh. Hmm. Huh. Province of Achaea. So you can either gain commerce value plus fifty percent, or yeah, sure. Let's get more people in there. I suspect that's going to be better in the long run. 
So I, st I still think we want to get rid of that one, because then we'll have quite a huge morale recovery. And we'll also have the uh, base morale being slightly higher. Then we'll just go and grab these beautiful, beautiful provinces. And, um, sure, let's go with that one. Alright, slave estate. So hopefully that should increase. Yeah, yeah. Increasing income a bit. Uh, did we have somewhere else where we couldn't buy? We got one built there, built there. I don't think we want this fort. Okay, we can't afford to build anything else there. If anything, we'd want a fort in the capital. Yeah. No, no, I'm going to attack you. Oh, and we do have an additional uh, import thingy now. First dates. Um, local freeman happiness. Not terrible. Marble. We do have spare marble. Fish or precious metals. None of which can be imported. Lose capital bonus, fish. Yeah, they're not too keen on that. Starting experience, local tribesmen, uh, dates, local freeman happiness. Guess that works. We have 10 slaves here. How much do we actually need for a surplus? 17. So we probably don't want all of these slaves here. But we're shifting them to... What are we producing here? Um, olives. That's not the same one. Seven pops can produce a lot of those things. Oh my god, yeah. Oh, we haven't actually got anything in this one. Nor that one. So we should definitely build something there as well. Okay. Right, October. We have lost that awful modifier, correct? Uh... Yes, we have. Right. So, is there any reason not to declare war? No. Yeah, we'll grab Terrani. So, you, my friend, are going to embark. You are going to go... Where's the actual port? There. And we're going to grab this magnificent uh, Colossus of Rhodes. Actually, let's slow down here. So, you are going to do a brave naval invasion and hopefully not lose. Let's see, tactic wise. We do a Rhino. Sure. Rhino versus Tortoise. Think we'll be okay. And don't know whether we can actually escape anywhere. I don't know, just in case, can we go and blockade him or something? 
He's definitely trying to escape. I'm not sure whether blockading is a thing. Let's see. Oh, yes, it is. Okay. Nice. Uh, yeah, that worked out pretty well. He was the general. So we don't have anyone, no? He seems fine to me. Not sure. Is he going to try and march around or something? Yeah, boat or people on those ships. Okay, he's hiding. Am I at war with you? No. No, I'm not. Well, let's go and blockade this. This should give... Maybe it doesn't matter which one of the provinces around I am. Let's try. Well, it's not at the moment, so no. Yeah, no, we need to be on the same side as where the port is. So yeah, let's go over there. Do you have that one? Perfect. So, surrender is currently at 29%. Surrender for me. No. Nope. I presume we can't really reinforce here. Uh, 125 it says, so maybe. But we're losing men quicker, because there's 21k standing here being really annoying. Uh, liberation. Regain popularity, they become a free man, free man. Um... Yeah, sure. We're going to get some slaves from this anyway, so... If this stupid thing can fall at any point... Let's see. We haven't managed to land any armies anywhere, so that's alright. Fall. Oh my god. I do have a fort on each individual province though, which is going to be slightly annoying, but hey-ho. Fall? Thank you. Yep, so we've gotten some slaves. Go in here and uh, embark. Yep, then we're going to go over here instead. And uh, so I actually managed to build up quite a few troops now. And this is another freaking uh, mercenary company here, which is annoying. I'm tempted to rent them just to move them away. Yeah, that's not looking very good at all. Can I... Uh, escape? I need to resupply my army. I 
I mean, it would be nice if I could cut them off and isolate them and put one of the armies on this one here. We'll see if we can do that. Let's just um, go back. I know we're suffering attrition from being at sea, but... can't actually see this from here. It's a bit unclear which provinces you can see or not, I must say. In mean, worst case scenario I can isolate both of the armies up there and I can just go and siege down this stuff here. But now we should have, yeah, two and a half thousand reaching them this month, so that's a lot better. Okay, now I can see them there. So that's 14k. Now stay here for now. Yeah, he's actually built up a very, very large army. That is fine, because if he's going to waste time over there, I can just go and siege down this province and peace out his ally. Um, which I think is exactly what I'm going to do. Embark yourself and move over there. Hope this will work might just be that because he controls both sides or something rubbish like that. But yeah, you will go there. Yes, we're of course going to hold the games. I haven't seen anything negative about holding the games, so... We like split this in half. Um, the man in charge has ordered the imprisonment of someone. Someone. Uh, okay. Okay, that, that was probably not the best idea. Oh! Oops. Should not fight without the commander. Where did the other ship go? You're fleeing all the way down there. Yeah. Okay. So you're fleeing to there. You flee to there as well. Okay. That was not the best of ideas. Right. Merge you. Are you dying of something? Hundred and ten ships, Jesus Christ. Now we don't actually have enough troops to ferry the whole thing around. Let's grab one more apartic and then bring them up there. Attempted bribery. Um, okay. 
Yeah, sure. Let's take that one. Um, but I think I'm going to call this an episode here. So thank you very much for watching. And I will see you in the next one. Bye-bye.